let's get it hello internet welcome back or welcome to my channel my name is Tori and today I have my pan that palette for 2019 this is the mid-year update let's jump right into it so as always we start off with the oldest boy first this is the Smashbox mini full exposure palette so this is what it currently looks like. I do not know the last goal I set off the top of my head, but my goal has been to hit pan in an update and then start making progress. So, move it in closer. Last update when I was filming, the day of filming, I noticed I had a little, like, it looked like a staple mark of pan in brown. It has now expanded to this. Since this was repressed, it's now very, um, what's the term it has a lot of fallout there's cr it crumbles everywhere kind of annoying but it's okay the brown pan is still nice and the same size the gray pan is pretty much still the same size and then this matte gray I have not found a use for yet now my goal for next update I want one of the browns gone that is final that is set that is a goal and I'm going to stick to it um, I'm starting in the summer. I work a professional office type job, so I do not go that crazy with the makeup. I can if I want to, but I like looking more professional than half the people that work there, to be honest. It kind of gives me a little boost of confidence. Um, so, brown makeup. I might dabble in, especially with this a little bit more, my outer crease or something. But I just want one of the browns gone. That is my goal. That is what I'm sticking to. And I, I think I can do it. I don't think that's a unreasonable goal. Next, I have the Tarte Tartlet Tease Mini Palette. So, this is what it currently looks like with my big acrylics in the way. Okay. So, I think I know what my goal was last time. And I think it was to finish Wink and then expand Pan in one of the shimmers. I expanded pan and crush as you can tell I actually have it all on my eyelids today um, but I have not been reaching for wink I knocked out two to three other um, cream type shades like this in the past month and then started working on one that's in a different palette and I hit pan on it and then once I finish it I will go back to wink because I need to use wink and expand pan on one of the shimmers and I did that with crush I think my goal for this one if I don't finish wink I want crush to be gone or at least halfway gone I think that's reasonable to keep up the progress on this one these two are going to be the death of me but for some reason I'm not that concerned with them yet now we have to talk about the big boy, the TARDIS Pro. So my goal for last month, my last update, was to finish one off and hit pan in a new one. This is what it currently looks like. I did have to repress Innocent down here and then I re-hit pan in it. Um, so messy. I hit pan in Ethereal. Oh my god, I hate showing you this palette. Hey, hey, hit pan and ethereal. Whimsical still doesn't have pan. The Franken shade for classic is pretty much almost done. That was the shade I was trying to, wasn't the shade originally I wanted to use up, but then I wanted to try to use it up. I have gotten close. It should be gone by next update. Vamp is getting a little bit more use. Um, this is no filter, it's still there. And I believe this is fierce. Yeah, fierce hasn't been used. Uh, Minx still has a nice dip. Mod has not been used. Profesh just still hasn't been used. The Franken shade for Chic was used a little bit. Indie was not used. Bold has been used a lot, but no dip. Um, no, like, difference. Edgy has been used a lot, but no difference. And then what I did with Trendy was I put it in a two pans to get more use out of it and use it up quicker because it isn't another project as well. Um, so I want to try to get more use out of it this way. So this counts as one, but it's the same shade in two different pants. So my goal for next time would be, I want the Franken shade for classic to be done. Maybe one new pan and one other finish. So two finished and one pan added. 
I think is the goal. Um, since I said before I'm going to be work is working in an office, I will reach for this more because innocent and like whimsy and ethereal and bold and edge will all get used or edgy, whatever it's called. They'll all get used. So I'm not too concerned. I feel like obviously I would like a little bit more progress, but I'm stuck with a lot of weird shimmers and a lot of mid-tone. I used or had to get rid of all of the easy shades. Like there's no more easy shades. It's just what I have to make progress on every day. So that is my current update. This is how I'm going. Let me know down below um, if you've used one of these palettes, what shade you find the hardest to use. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and all that jazz. And peace out, Girl Scout.